see how we can solve this quantic equation. Quantic because we have a power of four. Simply means that we are looking for four solutions. And how can we get four solutions from this? We can rewrite this as a difference of two squared. As in x exponent two, all squared will give us x exponent four, right? Then minus four exponent two. So this will also give us 16. So I am going to work this as a squared minus b squared, which is what? a plus b, a minus b, difference of two squared. So the first number will be x squared minus 4, since I use plus, then we use plus, into bracket x squared minus 4, still equal to 0. So what do we do? We are going to equate this equals to 0 or this equals 0. But within this, I can still see a difference of 2 squared. So let's say x squared 4 into bracket x squared minus 1, 2 squared. You can see this is also a difference of 2 squared. So maintaining this, I still get this into bracket x plus 2 x minus 2 equals to 0. So now we have three brackets, all will be equal to 0. So here, I'll be having x squared plus 4 equals to 0, whereby this must cross. So I have x squared equals to negative 4. Since we are looking for x, we find the square root on both sides. Meaning x will be equal to plus or minus the root of 4, negative 4. And if we have a square root of a negative number, it gives you i. So this is going to be plus or minus 2. As the square root of 4, then we have 4. I. This is 2 and positive 2i and negative 2i for this. Then here become x plus 2 equals to 0. Subtracting what? 2 from both sides, making x equal to minus 2. This is all. This is all. We take our x minus 2 equals to 0. Adding 2 to both sides give us what? x equals to 2. Meaning x is either 2 in the case of this, negative 2 in the case of this, or negative 2i. Let me just combine it. Plus or negative 1, 2i. Alright, thank you for watching. Like and share.